And we are in the midst of something that people are going to be talking about years from now, Jack, way when we're off TV, about the legacy that happened today in today. downtown Greenville. You, you really? With Unity, Unity Park. Park. This yeah. is, if you are from, you know, this area, you understand big things when they happen. Jamarcus Gaston is at Unity Park. It is opening. The official opening is about 56 minutes from now. But Jamarcus, there are all kind of things happening. I cannot wait to see everything. How is it looking? That's right. Good morning, Jack and Megan. We're here at Unity Park. And like you said, July of 2020 is when this project first broke ground. And here on May 19th, 2022, Unity Park is set for a grand opening. It's a 60 acre park. It cost over $60 million with some public and private funds used to be able to fund this. But it is a major, uh, a major situation. I want to take a look at it. Of course, there are uh, four different uh, playgrounds here, play areas. Like, like I mentioned, 60 plus acres, lots of green space. Uh, this all started back in 1907 when the landscape architect came, was commissioned by the city to decide three parks that would be perfect uh, for this city. Of course, it started all with Cleveland Park, followed by Falls Park, and today, Unity Park opens here in downtown Greenville. Of course, it uh, connects, it's called Unity Park because it connects uh, a segregated area at one point in our country's history. May Mayberry Park, which was a predominantly black park, and then uh, Meadowbrook, which was an all white uh, park there. Today, the city comes together with Unity Park. I had a chance to speak with Dr. Byron Battle from Tabernacle Baptist Church. Uh, this church has been in this community for 150 years. They're celebrating their anniversary uh, this year, this week, in fact. I had a chance to talk to him about what Unity Park means for this community. He's just steps away from the park. Take a listen to what he had to say. We are elated and excited uh, to be a part of this celebration today and to certainly celebrate Unity Park. I believe that the name Unity itself uh, literally is going to bring people of all races, all creeds and colors to come together to share in uh, a time of relaxation and fellowship and even a spiritual experience in that moment. I believe that that Unity Park is going to be the conglomerate by which we all come together and share in those experiences. So if you have kids, if you love to be out at, with, with your dog, like some of these folks are outside on the Swamp Rabbit Trail, this is going to be the place you want to come and check out. Again, 10 o'clock is when it actually opens. We're going to be taking you through some of the different events they're having here at Unity Park in downtown Greenville. But again, Unity Park opens today at 10 o'clock here in downtown Greenville. We're going to be talking about some more of the historical impacts of this space coming up a little later in the show with historian John Nolan. But I'll send things back to you, Jack and Megan, in the studio. Thank you, Jamar.